Hello, my name is Cindy Matalucci and you're watching The Pulse. We're out front of the Hellion Gallery in downtown San Diego. Tonight is their grand opening. It's called Terra de Agua, which means the land of water. And tonight it's consisting of three artists from the Get Vicious Collective. Marcelo Macedo from Brazil, Michael Kirst from New York, and Monstrino from San Diego. We're gonna go inside and meet the artists and see what it's all about. Let's do it. I'm Cindy with The Pulse and I'm here with the owner of the Hellion Gallery, Matt Wagner. How are you? Good, good. Thanks for having us here tonight. It looks like you're having a great event, a great showing. It seems to be going pretty good so far. Tell us about your gallery. I know you have locations in Portland. Uh, in yeah, Hellion, I started in Portland, but then I do shows in uh, Tokyo four to eight times a year. I do shows down here every two months and then every month at my gallery in Portland. That's good. Yeah. And how do you find your artists if they want to show their art here? It used to be I would just through friends, people would tell me about someone I liked. You know, in Japan, I just know a lot of people over there and I find new artists. But now a lot of times people, you know, they, they come to me and they bring their portfolio or they send me an email, website. And I'm, I'm totally, I'm great with that. Like, I look at every single one. Even if I hate it, I usually send an email back saying how much I hate it and they should stop doing it immediately. <laughs> no, you don't. <laughs> I don't do that. Well, how did you get involved in this industry? Uh, I went to I went to art school, but then I did other things. You know, I was a musician, and uh, and then I took jobs as an art curator at different galleries in Portland. And eventually, you just like anything else, you just realize if you're doing it yourself, you can do it a little better and the way you want to do it. I mean, this whole thing is like about making a viable economy for artists so that they're not struggling, so that they're not considered this like weird outcast kind of sect of society. It's like, you know, they should be able to get the same pay as anybody else for all the hard work they do. So I'm not really the kind of gallery that goes into inflating prices or like, you shouldn't come to me if you want to invest in art, but if you want really good art that no one's ever heard of and you want to support really awesome people that are, are full of integrity and honesty, I'm your guy. I love it. And tell us, what are your upcoming events that we can look forward to? Well, uh, this event, and then in March, I do two openings in my gallery in Portland. This event actually moves to Portland. Oh, wow. Um, there's a part two of Terra de Agua that opens in Portland on March 2nd at my gallery. And then I'm doing a photo exhibition of two photographers who delivered food into the earthquake uh, ravaged area of Japan after the quake. And they took photos of what was going on and how people were rebuilding their lives. And then then I go to Japan uh, mid-March and I do a show with Gage Hamilton um, there. You've got a lot going on. Well, tell us how to find you. What's your website address so people can look you up? Oh, www.helliangallery.com. Well, thanks for talking to us tonight. It was nice meeting you guys. I love San Diego. I know. It's the best stuff ever. It's really you got to come down to the Hellion Gallery on 3rd. Come down on Sundays during the farmer's market. It's really awesome. I'm here with Marcelo and Monstrino, Michael, two of these wonderful artists tonight with the Get Vicious Collective. So I want to know the story. How did you guys meet? Yeah, it's like a, it's a weird story because uh, I was painting. I, I have a, I had the paint in Guarda do Imbaú, South of Brazil. Okay. And Michael and Marilo had been there for a long time ago. And uh, and when I came to California, like my second time, I was painting music cafe, like a restaurant. Okay. And this guy came and said, "Hey, come on." Where are you from, man? And I said, where is this guy? Who's this guy? Yeah, the, Michael Marilla. And, <laughs> and he said, uh, you're from Brazil, right? And I said, yeah, how can you know that? And, and he said, man, you, I saw your painting in Guarda do Imbaú, south of Brazil. It was on the little stairs, like organic stuff. Wow, so you saw his painting when you were in Brazil? Yeah, I I went to Brazil and uh, we both share a common bond. We both love the ocean, and uh, I was down there on a trip and I saw his artwork. I didn't know who he was, and then like Marcelo said, I I saw him painting in Encinitas and I recognized the style immediately. And 
Yeah. You both are water guys, right? You both love the water. Yes. You can see that in your art. Yes. It's very important, I think, because uh, Marcelo grew up in Rio de Janeiro, Brazil. And I was born in New York, but I was raised on Long Island near the ocean. Strong Island. Yeah, Strong Island. <laughs> and uh, I think the ocean is very important to both of us. It's a element that that affects our artwork and who we are as people. Now tell me about this Get Vicious Collective. It started in New York, right? Yeah, Get Vicious is like uh, like an American crew that they is like designers and creative persons, you know. Like music and art. Yeah, creative okay. people that have something in common, you know, like friends, good friends, little community and Michael invited me to get in to, to this group okay. and I was very proud to get in and meet everybody. So we become friends and starting, started to talk more and make, and he, when I went to New York last year to make an exhibition, he was there and he he find some he found some walls okay. to paint you know, on five points oh, cool. and it was awesome and then he invited me to make this show with him and Michael Kirsten and Michael's from New York as well right yeah I think like Marcelo said it best it's uh, I think all of us share the the love for just creation and like a positive attitude but he inspires me and I hope to inspire him and everybody that's part of our collective does music or design and is like very positive first it's all about the person first and then the creative mindset comes second okay. well, tell us where we can find you so you're obviously here at Hellion Gallery yes. where else are you guys going to be showing your work? a website on Facebook What's your website address? Yeah, it's www.marcelomacido03.com uh, Okay, perfect. And Facebook, Marcelo Macido. So you can look it up on Facebook. And what about you? You've got a website, Monstrino? Sure. Uh, I go, mine's www.monstrino, M-O-N-S-T-R-I-N-H-O. It means little monster in Brazilian Portuguese dot com. And, uh, we also have a Facebook of Get Vicious, and the other artist who wasn't here, unfortunately, he's in New York, Michael, hello, I love you, he's, a, he's good people. It's Michael Kirst, M-I-C-H-A-E-L, Kirst, C-U-R-S-E-D.com. And he's an unbelievable artist and a dear friend. Well, thank you so much for talking to us and having us here tonight. Check out these guys' website. Their work is amazing. Hi, I'm here with Gloria Muriel, one of the female artists from the Get Vicious Creative. How are you? Good, good. Thank you very much. This is your piece right here. Yes. I love it. It's gorgeous. So tell us about your work. I think it's empowering girls and it's just a state of being, living right here in the in the now and being conscious of who we are and what are we capable of. Because we're strong, we're women. Exactly, <laughs> exactly. So how did you get involved with the creative, with the guys, Marcelo? Uh, with the collective. Um, Mike Amarillo was the one who reached out and he said he really appreciated what I do and so he invited me and I checked out um, what it was about and I really liked the artists that were there. So I was like, alright. like such a great group of guys. They're awesome, they're awesome. We help each other, we, um, we paint together, we collaborate in every way we can. And I love it. You're like one of two women, right? That yeah. is part of it? Yeah, exactly. Uh, Kristen is in New York. I'm here in San Diego. So we're trying to do our best and just, you know, give a positive reaction to the whole everybody, you know? I love it. Well, tell us how we can find your work. If somebody wants to buy one of your pieces, how do we find you? Uh, you can go to my website. It's my name, GloriaMuriel.com. And I'm also on Facebook. And will, we be, will you have another event where you're showing your work? I'm going to paint a big mural for an opening in Mexico. I'll be there. And then I have some of my prints. I have them at uh, North Park in the Mission Cafe. And I'll be on Saturday painting live at Torello Gallery also. I love it. Well, come check this powerful woman out. Thank you.